Previously, on Welcome back. Evil Previously on Zero Mode, we were playing Resident Evil. Resident Evil. We lost contact with there was some giant ball sacks. I mean, I was play I've played about half an hour of this game, and it I don't need to be told this again. But I feel like something's here. Yeah, zombies. I think it's a gun. Or is this one of the games where they say like don't call them zombies? Look at that ass! Do they ever say that zombies in Resident Evil? I don't think they do, actually. Like The Walking Dead. The Walking Dead, they never call them zombies. It's like it's like a zombie trope now, isn't it? Like, don't say the Z word. Yeah, I mean, I don't... I suppose it depends on the sort of universe you're trying to create. I yeah. think The Walking Dead does it well. Kind of... They're just the walkers, aren't just they? Just walkers or roamers yeah. or... Depending on where you're from. Double mystery! But, I mean, you could do a probably good meta sort of zombie thing where... Say like Shaun of the Dead, they know, they're called zomb they know what zombies are. Yeah, yeah, like, don't say the Z word. But they did that where it's like, what... You could create like a universe where people think you have to stab them through the head, but that makes no difference. Yeah, yeah. And you've just been taught wrong through... Through zombie movies. Through zombie movies. That'd be a pretty good one. Like, what if people who loved zombie movies actually had to live through a zombie apocalypse and everything they thought they knew was wrong? Uh, that's a fucking film idea. Copyrighted. You can't copy that. We've said it. We've said it. In the time it took us to uh, get this episode up, we've copyrighted it, so don't even think about it. Oh, yeah. She went high hills. Down, Chris. We're almost there, Jessica. What? Chris is not going that quickly. I certainly hope so. My feet are killing me. It's uh, one of my most hated dialogue things. When two characters are like, Hey, come on, let's go, Chris. And the other person's like, "All right, I'll be there in a second, Jessica." <laughs> like, maybe it's the weather, but I still can't introduce them. People don't say each other's names that much. Who'd have thought we'd be stuck out here for so long? Like, you you never do it, do you? When you're sat with a mate, like you never ever say their name out loud unless they're like in a crowd. Yeah, of course not, Nathan. <laughs> oh. oh. The plane. <laughs> what plane? Oh my God. Where? There was a plane. I don't know what you're talking about. There shouldn't be any shipping routes in this area. Roots. The intel we got Roots. Velcro was on the money. Come on. Head for the crash site. No fucking way. All right, come on. Has he got scissors in his backpack? Yeah. What? Is he going to do some sewing? Do a little bit of knit work or something? Some cr arts and crafts? Some crocheting. I don't have a scanner. Quick, I'll crochet the scene. <laughs> I'm gonna need some more red. <laughs> Let me know if you find anything. Let me know if you find anything. Right, number one, a crashed plane. Does that count? Does that count as evidence? Where? It's mine for the biohazard symbol. Oh! Faint traces of a virus here. Ah, chicken's gone off. Uh, oh man, this this is definitely coming back to me now. I played this game. <laughs> that oh, clipboard. A clipboard. Perfectly. Staff meeting, minutes. When handling the special prototype, oh, blah, blah, blah. Once the prototype's cool, uh, Don't care. I'm, I'm really bad at uh, listening to... Not on, I, I listen to game mechanics and stuff, but when it's like game lore and stuff and I want you to sit and read it, I'm like, fucking yeah, no I was, way. I kind of liked um, the Arkham games where... You can get a tape, listen to it, but whilst you're walking around. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Don't stop the fucking game. Um, that's what I've been enjoying about Bloodborne. Bloodborne, there's no... Like, on the loading screens there's stuff, but um, there's no, like, hey, come read this and blah, blah, blah. Like, everything's inferred. Yeah, I think that's what's so good about, like, Zelda games as well. Like, kind of... You know there's a history, but it's not mm. signposted. So you don't have to read everything. Yeah, it just yeah. kind of lets you know that yeah, things have gone on. Oh, <laughs> there's a big boxes for a single clip of ammo. I don't have a much respect for whoever was uh, in charge of that. Oh, I don't use the shotgun ammo. Yeah, it's definitely not a lot of lore actually in the Zelda games. But then go on YouTube. Fucking yes, mate. But yeah, it's like it, there's a history you can kind of. We should check out the plane more thoroughly. See what we find. Feeny to what, what did, old matey boy. What did you find, eh? I fucking found loads. Have I got a scanner with Chris as well? Cool, right. Um, I've 
spent so much time uh, watching like <laughs> Zelda theories on YouTube and stuff. I do it constantly. Yeah. Picked up flight plan. What? Like, I go through like. Manifest should give us a lead to work with. Get into like a YouTube like roofy cycle. Mm. <laughs> roofy cycle. <laughs> <laughs> That's where they are. It's a blob. Take us there. Oh, okay, fucking. Oh God, Jesus Christ! Let me play the game. Hard to say. I find it difficult to believe they survived Terra Grigia, though. Stop saying Terra Grigia. Twenty-nine. All right, I need to find some more blobfish. Um, there's a really good guy um, for Zelda theories. Uh, it's a young British guy what called Zeltic. Carrying. Okay. Um, make contact with HQ. Because there's a lot of Zelda theories online. I'm not gonna name anybody, but there's a couple of people that are Americans. I can't fucking stand them. I don't. I, not because they're American. I love Americans. I, I lo watch a lot of American programs, but sometimes, like the solo YouTuber, when it's someone really, really young, and like, hey everybody, welcome to this week's video of blah blah blah. I'm like, alright, sorry, you seem lovely, but you're too much for me. Yeah, I was watching um, some videos just yesterday, actually. I uh, can't remember the name of the channel, so I can't slag them off properly. <laughs> can't even slag them off if I wanted to. And I fucking want to. Uh, <laughs> and I had to switch off straight away. Yeah. Yeah. The guy, uh, huge props to Zeltic. He's awesome. He's in uni as well. He's just super young. Um, I feel like I'd scanned everything. Literally, like, Z-E-L-T-I-K. Hit him up. Um, he's got a really nice, low voice. And he's like, today we're going to be looking at the footage from the Jimmy Fallon Switch video and stuff like... I fucking love him. He's great. Alright, nothing in that box. I mean, there's someone I follow called Dan Brown. Um, he's British and he's got this kind of real slow sort of voice. Mm -hmm. And uh, first of all, he sounds a bit boring, but after a while, Jessica, I need a hand. becomes oh perfect. He's not, yeah. he's not just shouting at you, he's actually yeah. really going in depth with games. That's it, that's a, a lot of YouTubers shouting. And he goes into game mechanics as well, which I quite like. like Hmm. I've sent you one of his videos actually about like, the way Mario levels are built. Oh, you're right. And he really thinks about certain mechanics and mm. he has a great series on Zelda dungeons. Awesome. Um, oh, how they're designed. Should have worn thermal coming. underwear. <laughs> 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 All right, Barry. Uh, Chris, even. Oh, Barry. <laughs> Should have worn the right underwear, not that thong. Okay. I told you it was a bad idea. Did you, Did you hear that? Yeah, we're about to get wrecked by some icy zombie wolves. Um, have you ever seen the Sequelitis videos? Ah! No. They're, oh my god, fuck I these guys. Careful, um, See? This is why I liked uh, <laughs> no I'm a girl! Still. I like small dogs! <laughs> mm. Fucking hell, these games are so like horribly old school sexist. <laughs> that way, doesn't it? We're in the right underwear, right, Jessica? Yeah. Um, oh fuck, I pressed that button again, I didn't mean to. You did right. not want to do that. Must remember, X is greenery. Why is that an automatic button? Oh, I suppose it's probably a good idea if you're not an idiot, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Or if you are an idiot, so you can yeah, yeah. quickly move. I accidentally pressed the wrong button. Uh, yeah, the sequel lights videos, they're done by Egoraptor, who's one half of the Game Grumps guys. And he just fucking took that like a champ. Go on, go down. Come on, mate. What? He's just not moving. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> super dark. Uh, yeah, he does these videos comparing one game in a series to its sequel and talking about the evolution of game mechanics, what one does right, what one does wrong. Um, he's done a few. He's done a few. Ones on Castlevania. One's on Mega Man and Mega Man X, and then he does one on A Link to the Past and Ocarina of Time as well. Um, okay. Goes really, really in depth into level design, um, gameplay mechanics, the feel of a game, teaching people through showing and like how games evolved and what worked and what didn't. Um, the Sequel Lights videos are fucking brilliant. I like the sound of that. Yeah, and they're, they're fully animated as well. He animated them. And scripted them, so they're they're really funny. Um, though he hasn't made them in a very long time, and he gets loads of shit for that from people. Uh, yeah, I find it 
when you find someone you really like, kind of like, mm -hmm. start going through the videos and then realise they stopped actually making videos a long yeah. time ago. Because it's fucking, it's hard to do. I, I mean, I, you know, I've got, I've got no idea of how much work it must take. Oh shit! No pooch, no. Ah! Is that me? Ah! I can take that. One in the nose. I always hate killing dogs. I think these ones are alright to kill. Yeah, I know, I know, but like, no matter what game it is, I'm always like, oh, why does it have to be a dog? Why can't it be a cat? Uh, grenade type sub weapon, it lets out unique sound. Okay, cool, cool. For grouping enemies and just slash them with a the shotgun. Okay, cool. Am I allergic on the shotgun? Um, like, even in the, Resident Evil, the original Resident Evil, when it's dogs, I'm like, oh, make it cats, man. Like, <laughs> fucking. I hate cats. I, I don't hate them, it's a strong statement, but they're just not as good as dogs. I don't think it's much as good as dogs. Ah! Take that, pooch. Uh. Oh, oh, Jesus. Whoa. Where did that one come from? Son of a bitch. Get it, he's a dog. Uh, right, that's not good. <laughs> Viewers won't be able to see this, but we just had a big box appear on our TV screen. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. I'll save you, Jessica. Yeah, my TV just uh, like, told me it's going to turn off in five minutes. Which I think it's pretty rude, because like the TV's still going. Oh, my God. there's too many dogs! No! I just shot another paw. Sorry. If I could cure you and rescue you, I would. Oh, there's a big one. Fucking have it. Rib cages are really unsettling as well. See, I think that's why it's a. Your phone's killed. I mean, yeah, I mean, the game's not going to punish me like, well, you, no, killed, you, you, you killed those dogs back there. You can't cure them after that. No, you can't be cured of outside rib cage itis. It's kind of a. Which is a fish man. <laughs> it's kind of a one way trip. Right, okay. What's up? Jill, was it? You don't want to talk about the dogs? She was your partner before, right? Shut up, yeah, my partner from before. What about it? <laughs> I was, you know, just asking. So are you uh, are you single? Are you seeing anybody? <laughs> it's not the time or the place. I'm not wearing any thermal underwear. <laughs> or any non-thermal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's a time and place. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna do my best. Again, whoever packed these uh, these crates did not do a good job. And whoever distributes them. Mm hmm. Ah, cool, sweet. Why are they distributing them in caves? Oh, well, this is from the plane crash, I think, is the, the assumption. Oh, no! Oh, I, I hope I don't get my foot stuck and surrounded by dogs. Just my leg, don't worry. Uh oh, poochies. Ah, right oh, fucking Jesus! All right, fucking. Easy. Let me change the shotgun. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, fucking hell! I don't say this often. This could be too many dogs. Now of all times. I'm on my period! <laughs> Fucking... Ah! Oh. Ah, oh, come on! This is actually quite tense, I like it. Fucking... No! Not German Shepherds! I think it's painting them in a bad light. They're good dogs. Ah! Oh. Fucking hell. I'm not sure I'll give you some hopes. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Me and this sweet tush. I don't want to sexualize her anymore. Oh my fucking I think, god. I think it's Capcom though, isn't it? They're not very good with female characters. Yeah. Oh Jesus. Ah! Help me out! Jessica. Oh, 
freaking out. No, no, no! Bad Papa! No! Oh, oh. Take that. What, what? How many more? Jesus! Any more hits? No! Uh -oh. I would have used it. Ah! And that one. Come on, it's gotta be it. No, no. Can you stand? Oh, just right. the tugs. I'll be okay. Bloody thing. Right. Oh. Sorry to bring this up again, but. <laughs> bring what up? Do you <laughs> trust me as much as Joe? Fucking hell. Oh, someone's no got issues, haven't they? Yeah. Trust you both. She's my ex. Don't worry Besides, about it, baby. Trust is built through actions, not words. That's so my It's always about the job. <laughs> Always about the oh, job. Rich. Speaking of jobs, <clears throat> <clears throat> I, I like how his leg was broken a second ago and uh, seems to have been miraculously cured. Okay, cool. Right, well, next time we'll come back. More Resident Evil Revelations. Because uh, I feel like I'm about to die and I don't want to end it when he dies. I don't want to start when he dies. Doesn't matter. Fuck it. We'll be back. See you next time, guys. See you next time.